As was the case with the geometric distribution, there is also a second parameterization for the negative binomial distribution. Here is a summary of what we've seen so far. If x is a negative binomial random variable with parameters r and p, and that's negative binomial with a small n, that models the number of failures before the rth success in IID, and IID stands for independent and identically distributed Bernoulli trials. And in that case, the probability mass function looks just like this for a parameter r, which is a positive integer, and a parameter p, which is between 0 and 1. Well, some people, instead of using the number of failures before the rth success, like to use the trial number of the rth success. And in that case, we use a capital N to uh, uh, differentiate between uh, this negative binomial and this negative binomial. And it's still got the same parameters r and p. But now, the trial number can begin on the rth trial. So instead of the support starting at 0, it now starts at r. And the derivation goes along the same lines. Notice that now we have still the p to the r for the r successes. The 1 minus p now gets raised to the x minus r power. And this combination becomes this. And basically, you have the same type of thinking that goes on. But this is simply a negative binomial random variable that starts at 0, shifted r units to the right. So this is true for some positive integer r, p-values between 0 and 1, and again, capital N, negative binomial random variable. Not much changes with this new parameterization. The population mean does change to r over p, but the population variance, skewness, and kurtosis all remain the same. Keep in mind with computer languages that r parametrizes the negative binomial by default, from 0, whereas Apple parametrizes the negative binomial distribution from R. Again, one is lowercase n, the other is uppercase n. It only tells you if the support is starting at 0 or if it is starting at R.